Hi guys, we are here for my creative year for March, talking about old and new. That's our topic for the month. This week we're talking about reworking old projects in particular. So I know a bunch of us have old projects, half finished projects, things we didn't like the way they turned out. We've all got them, me included including a lots of painted canvas that I either am over or I don't like the way it turned out or I don't want to rework it. So I took a lot of it and I took them off the canvas, off the wood frame. I ripped them down into these pieces. Which okay guys, right about here I'm going to cut into my video footage for this video and let you know I have a tutorial for exactly how to make these already on my YouTube channel. So I wanted to film this as a reminder and not another full tutorial because I've done it already. That being said, I think it's a great idea. It works with the monthly topic and this week's prompt so, so, so well. I can't even tell you. And you can make one of these reusing stuff that you already have repurposing the old things you already have in your creative space besides just a canvas. So I am going to link the video description for how to make these in the description below. And I may, if I can, insert a few clips and um, footage here, right about here, while we continue talking about repurposing an old canvas. Pieces which are about... 12 by like seven and a half. And then I take these and I embellish them and I turn them into a journal cover. I have quite a stack here. I also take the smaller pieces and I will sometimes sew them together. You can see there's an eyeball right there. Um, I'll sew them together, sometimes from different canvases, and again, make an embellishment for a journal page, make a journal cover. I make a lot of journal covers out of these, and when I'm creating them, I add lots of different pieces and parts to the canvas first different trims that I have, um, maybe old painty papers and other artwork that I didn't like the way it turned out until I have a cover that I'm happy with. And I just sew it on my sewing machine. Once I have something I like, I add paper to it and turn it into a junk journal. Um, I, I like to have an elastic here on the back to keep it closed. Um, I do use these. I do sell them sometimes in my Etsy shop. This is just one of many things that you can do with your stack of old, <laughs> ugly canvas you have at home. Now, here on my channel, you've seen me repaint canvases. You've seen me do it many, many, many times. I'll keep doing it. Sometimes I get tired of repainting things and I turn it into journals. So whichever one works for you, but if you have an old piece of artwork, especially one you're not happy with, there's a lot of things you can do with it. Think of taking it off the frame and doing something else with it. Turn it into a journal cover. It might make a really nice one. That's it for today. Go over and check my creative year for any notes, news, tips, materials lists, your daily creative word and more. The link is in the description below. The most important thing besides liking, sharing, and subscribing is to go out and have a great day. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it and I'll see you later. Bye guys.